So then faith cometh by hearing and hearing by the word of God. We can sit in, putting the radio waves with the gospel. We can sit in, church up in your home like an apostle. We can sit in, after hearing and doing it big for the Lord. We can sit in, putting in work, serving the King, answering His we call. We can sit in, interviews, gospel talk, watch the anointing fall. We can fall. sit in, loving Jesus Christ, repping He's the Lord. We can sit in, we all about Christ and lifting Him up. We can sit in, love but Majesty and power reigning from His throne. We can sit in, call us doctors 'cause we got Your healing remedy. We can sit in, for the saints and even the folks that ain't no.
upon his throne.
majesty let all the earth rejoice all the earth rejoice he wraps himself in light and darkness tries to hide and trembles at his voice trembles at his voice how great is our god sing with me how great is our god and all will see how great how great is our god
The perpetrators reported Daniel's actions And the king became overwhelmed with dissatisfaction But sir, you signed a law, so you can't turn around and break it The king's hands was tied with absolutely no way to shake it So the guards led Daniel to the den of hungry lions Tossed him in and left, no way of escaping death King Darius paced the floors all night long I wonder if Daniel made it was the king's silent song But little did he know that Daniel prayed to God again And the great Jehovah Jireh sent an angel to the den The angel closed the mouths of the lions all night At the break of dawn the king ran to the den consumed with fright Daniel cried to king with hopeful anticipation Did the Lord keep you safe in such a dead end situation? Yes, Daniel answered Then the king was overjoyed Lift him out at once Then the perpetrators was lunch Then the king tossed the perpetrators into the lion's den And before their bodies could hit the ground The lions devoured them Then the king passed the law That throughout his whole kingdom That the God of heaven and earth should be praised Daniel cried out to God on the daily And the great Jehovah Jireh sent an angel to the den Daniel cried out to God on the daily And the great Jehovah Jireh sent an angel to the den Daniel cried out to God on the daily And the great Jehovah Jireh sent an angel to the den Daniel cried out to God on the daily And the great Jehovah Jireh sent an angel to the den Okay, gentlemen, I'm here. I know you have much to say, so lay it on me. RBD, thank you for joining us. We've come together and called this meeting because the rap industry is in a state of emergency. Since the days when legends once ruled this industry with the gangster rap dynasty they once were affiliated with, the world of West Coast rap has not been the same. You see, Reborn, the music industry has chosen the route it is headed to in the future. It's more of a darker, slower style of rap. Very popular within southern communities in North America. Look, we have an idea that represents a change. Exactly. We feel the music industry cannot grow and go in the direction that it should if you continue to make West Coast rap. Change is good. Indeed. We feel that it is in your best interest as an artist and a performer to move in the same direction that the music industry is headed to in the future. What we are suggesting will only prolong your career. As well as taking your career to greater heights than it's ever known. Listen, if you want to stay in the game, you got to update your sound. No more West Coast 1996 G-Funk era is over, you know. And honestly, you're not getting any younger. Change is good. But nevertheless, hallelujah, the gospel will be preached. For the longevity of your career, it's really in your best interest to become one with Crunk. It's, it's time, time to get Crunk. Now, Reborn, what do you have to say on your behalf of our suggestion? <laughs> Keep it west coast till the Lord come down. 
So read the script of John 14, 3 And let the Lord just ride and prepare your chest I'm the God in the world I come west when I'm preaching with There's a preacher way out I stand up and exalt the name And just so you know I'm staying true to my boots on the streets and the army is west coast. I feel like music so twisted, rappers who ain't gifted, yelling out chants like a medium of bitches. I keep a real, ain't afraid to hold my tongue. I'm a rep Christ side till the day the kingdom come. Up and down, can't make up your mind. What style to represent? Spitting out foolish rhymes. Midwest, down south, east coast, representing who they are. Standing hard with folded arms. I come west and I'm built like that. I won't emulate a genre and sell out fast. Real music, I work with a passion. G Funk, Gospel Lace, another classic. So take this, let it bless your ride. Every out of word I speak, guess who I magnify? I'm out to resurrect the West on your radio. Like the Lord said, reach out to win souls. Like the God is beautiful. I come west when I'm preaching well. Stand up and exalt the name And just so you know I'm staying true to my boots on the streets And the RBD is I like to lay back, reminisce on them days East side chilling with my homies in the PJs And I'm back and I'm carrying the cross A new life made up, cheat like the boss Feeling good, let the Lord run things When you take a look at me, I done release the pain Curse free, sentimental when I call the name Transform to God, reborn for the last days I use music cause it's so influential Secular heads being pimped by the devil Illuminati running wild on your record Mind control, I bleed the blood, ain't affected I stand firm, so the ground won't break Speaking fire from the word and the beat that makes And Big J got my back in the ministry Throwing up West Hollywood is the death I come west when I'm preaching well. There's a preacher radio. I stand up and exalt the name. And just so you know, I'm staying true to my roots on the streets and the Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Alex Wignor, uh, as well as a local Tucson newspaper that Arizona Congresswoman Gabrielle Giffords has been shot. We do not know the circumstances and details of return. We have Not On Your Side team coverage of day seven of the search for Isabel. Not On Your Side's Marcelino Benito. The shooting of 17-year-old Trevon Martin in Florida. 
even a 28-year-old George Zimmerman, a neighborhood watchdog, shot the teenager dead in San Francisco. A massive shootout that took place 12 miles southwest of the Nogales port of entry. 29 people are dead and at least six others are wounded. Of us, we should do everything we can do to make sure this country lives up to our children's expectations. Church is at where our church is at. And it's the place where we rap here. The heart of God will never end here. This is for the residents who never left here. They shouldn't take tragedy and murder for our president to get here. I yeah. rap here in his name, and even if it costs my life, this is for the victims that we lost on the night. It's a prayer for my city for a call next night. It's dark, we're bringing in the light. Light. This is my To the Lord, promise dudes will use the word of the sword. Cause we don't wanna cope with the Satan to the most high. Praying for my city, we ain't here to genocide. So I rise, time to gather the truth. Take back the city, yeah, I'm praying for the youth. Cause I am living proof that we can all change. Always speak the word and never be ashamed. Cause we've been called by God to preach kingdom. So every time I spin on the track, it's what I bring them. And to the victims, I'm praying for your families. I hope you know Christ find country in your tragedy. Cause it hurts to see innocent so so it's brought a man up and realize who's above. He died on the cross, rose on the third day. Gotta believe me, that's just what my word say. And when word play, no. I don't switch it up When he called me, yeah, I'ma give it up My soul, my heart, my mind It's about Christ, I ain't never tryna shine My grind, my passion, my pain To live is Christ and to die is gain Cause when it rains, it pours of course Can't wait to see my God on the white horse yeah. This is my prayer
everybody. Uh, we have another episode of the Gospel Discussion Show. I'm Elder Byron Herndon here with the on, one and only the Battleground. How you fellas doing? Right, right, Battleground, right, right. Battleground, Battleground City. City. Battleground City. Y'all, that's right. Y'all straightened me up. <laughs> <laughs> and I think that is that Miss Battleground City over there. <laughs> that's Miss Kid. That's Miss Kid. Okay. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm here with with the, with you guys. I heard you guys out there cranking it up, cranking it up. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that. Said had the little kids out there. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. You know, um, we need to we need to um train them up, train the child up in the way it should go, and then never depart from it. You know. Um. So tell uh, who's the, who's the spokesman of the group. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> okay, I'll tell you what, uh 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 I'll just go back and forth. Okay. First of all, let me do this. Your name is? The Messenger. Bridge the Kid. Psalm Star. Nate the Mac. And Ryan, aka Rhino. AKA Rhino, alright. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, we had to get that soft voice in there. And the little baby's name is? That's Shane Wilson. Okay, Shane. I know you ain't old enough to speak yet, but you'll be rapping pretty soon. <laughs> um, how did you guys um, become about? Um, man, we, we started about three years ago. Um, it started off with three of us, um, myself, Songstar, The Messenger, and uh, Robert, not the, the Ark, or Rob Mercury along with Ryan and we just started doing it was first conferences um, every June in Tucson and then uh, we decided in 2010 to uh, start a mixtape to give out to the youth who were coming to our conferences and give them something to put in their hands mm -hmm. that they can go home with and for free for free there we go you gotta, you gotta add that. That. Amen. <laughs> and then from there man uh, we just people started getting to know us we started to network and started getting out there man and just really just saw what God was trying to do with this and so we've been doing free mixtapes at least every almost every year that we that we've been uh, doing this. now are you, are you are you sampling are you creating your own stuff both both, both? yeah Who, who's you guys let's see I'm, I'm old school so who's the oldest in the group I'm the old messenger how old are you? 35 okay how about you? you gotta wait you still young <laughs> so um I would say EWF. You guys use a little bit. Of e or do y'all know who that is? No. Earth, Wind, and Fire. Y'all don't talk about. No. Initially, we haven't sampled any really older stuff. Um, we try to keep it current. Uh -huh. You know. Um, I sampled something a little bit older, like Anthony Hamilton on one of my mixtapes that's going okay. to come out, so, okay. you know, stuff like that. So you guys do mainly, like, gospel, is it, like, gospel samples, like, from... We from, take Christian hip-hop yeah. beats, um, actual artists like Lecrae, Trip okay. Lee, Andy Minio. We take their beats and we remake the song, we mixtape it, but we also have an engineer that's Bloodbirth, Amadeus. Um, he makes his own beats and Robert Mercury, Rob the Art, okay. he makes his own beats too. So it, it, it depends. We don't do too much sampling. We beat snaps, per se. Okay. Yeah, and and we, have people that, we have people like Messenger has people that give him beats. Mm -hmm. uh, we purchase songs, beats. Yeah, so I'm sorry. We'll go on and purchase beats. Um, so we have original. We have in-house production. We have uh, uh, beat snatching that we do. So. Mm -hmm. We we try to keep it mixed up and and uh, well you know y'all brothers got Backbone Records too right here right, right, right you know right, we got right, Pastor Perry yeah. and, 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 and um um uh, Stephen Perry Pastor Perry okay, yeah. and Pastor Corey both they do from what I understand they're pretty good they're pretty good matter of fact they're both working on a new theme song for me oh, okay. when you guys hear my show that is me. <laughs> I'm no yeah, rapper. It's good, it's good. I'm right. no rapper, you but but I did I did you know somebody said well go back to the heavy D days or I yeah. did the ho 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 you know but that's gonna be well, out, that's gonna be obliged. It's, it's your signature though. That's, <laughs> not, that's real cool, man. But uh, so. another thing that um, we also do is when we come out with our own separate projects because mm -hmm. we all solo artists as well. Okay. So when we put something out and I put like a CD on iTunes, that's when it's all original beats because we can't sell someone else's beats. Yeah. So we do have an album on iTunes so when we do our original stuff well we I do get beats that we buy or people give us mm -hmm. and it's all original stuff so that them ones we don't sample nothing else okay now who, who sings everybody is everybody rapper or do somebody uh, sing, sing. He's okay. Singing rap. Yeah. okay 
So I'm starting singing to rap. Everybody else is rapping except for myself. I think I can I sing in the shower, but no. Nah. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like you. Matter of fact, I sing in the shower and the dogs still run away. So you know. I, I sing, you know what I mean. But they, they try not to let me go. Out there too much. Nah, uh, I try to do Payne's backups. <laughs> <laughs> but I make sure the mic's like five feet away. From me. Yeah. So um um see what I want what I want to know is do you guys have any what is the name of your your current album that's out right now? Um it's called Ghostbusters. Um we actually got two currently out right now. We got a uh, Ghostbusters mixtape um okay. and then we also got City of Ashes Volume 3 which is more of our current stuff, but that's more of a uh, exclusive uh -huh. um exclusive thing that we hand out at concerts and people can get from us from our direct sites. Um, we also got a couple of uh, solo projects out. Rob Mercury, um, he's currently in uh, Sacramento right now. He has his mixtape called The Origins of Hip Hop. Okay. Um, I also have my uh, solo project called City Bus Chronicles, which is out. Um, we, like he said, uh, Messenger said he has his album on mm -hmm. iTunes, The Lord is My Ghost Rider. Those, okay. are, those are the projects we're pushing out right now. And then we well, like I said, um, speaking of Rich, uh, Brother Corey. Pastor Kari over there. Make sure y'all get with him so y'all don't have to keep sampling them beats. He'll hook you guys up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, you know, I had to plug them. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, um, 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 do you guys, do you guys, um, I'm trying to think of questions. I've been asking different questions all day. Um, do any of you guys have something that you want to say to the public? What I do, I'll, I'll turn, turn it around. Do you guys have any, anything that you want to tell the kids or, or a message that you want to give the young people? I mean, a lot of what I do is I just tell them that, you know, I even have a song, Lowercase Eyes, just saying it's not about us. Because mm -hmm. sometimes, you know, when they see you on the stage, they put you like on a pedestal. And we never want none of that. All of us are humble mm -hmm. and we just like them. So all we're doing is trying to just deliver a message that God has given us to deliver to the, you know, to the youth. And um, we never want to be idolized or anything like that. Mm -hmm. So we, you know, that's one of the messages that I push is like, don't idolize us. We just up here making music that's, you know, for the youth, trying to encourage them to seek a relationship with Christ. Amen. Amen. I receive I that. Say, one thing I'd like to say is, you know, to kids out there that might not be, you know, fully saved or they might just be thinking about it, you know, just be encouraged, you know what I mean? Because it's real hard. I know how hard it is to to be a kid, you know what I mean, in this world and, and, and try to live your life for Christ, you know what I mean? You're going to have a lot of people telling you, hey man, don't do that, that's whack, you know what I mean? Come chill with us, come kick it with us, you know, we'll treat you right, but, you know what I mean? Just be encouraged, man, you know, just just stick it out because in the end, it's, it's going to be better for your life, you Amen. know what I mean? And, there, and there's people out there that, uh, that'll have your back, you know what I mean? Just, you know, get connected to some kind of local body, some kind of church. Mm -hmm. And, uh, That's it. you know what I mean, That's stay, it. stay connected, you know? You know, one of my, one of my, one of my themes is that um, when I do every a broadcast, I don't like to not leave a broadcast with opening up Christ to somebody yes. and without a prayer. And one of my, th one of my favorite sayings is, find a Bible-believing church, a Bible-teaching church. Amen. Absolutely. Because it, it's not, we're not the ones going to save yeah, that yeah. person. It's okay. what the Word of God is what's going to save that person. Amen. And then, and you guys, ministry of music, that, you never know who it touches. Yeah, yeah. You know, I don't care if the Bible says whether two or three are gathered in his name. Yeah. So if you, if you touch just one out of those two or three, then you guys as saints done your job, yes. you know. Yes. Um, um, will you guys be performing anywhere else soon? Uh, yeah, 30 and 31st. Uh, 30 and 31st, next weekend, um, we have a conference coming up called Awakening the Generation. Okay. It's a Friday night and a Saturday morning. And the Friday night is the youth service. Uh, Battleground City will be performing uh, John Coates, who is the FCF International Youth Pastor, um, will be there speaking. Uh, we'll have a praise team. And that is in Tucson. It's uh, uh, 4108 East North Street. It's uh, uh, The location is Living Faith Christian Center. And then the next day is a minister's breakfast um, where John Coates will also be teaching, and that's at FCF uh, Church in in, in, uh, in Tucson, Arizona. Also, so are you, Pastor Virgil Stokes and John Smith. Are you guys at the same church? No, no. And what's your ministry church that you go to? I go to Agape Christian Church International, and that's Pastor Moss, and then Ridge. Um, we all three, uh, Ridge, Psalmstar, and Ryan, we all go to Living Faith Christian Center, which is okay. Pastor Randy Winkles. Okay. And I go to. Lighthouse Church International. It's uh, done by Apostle Jesse West. Okay. Okay. Well, that's good to hear. Um, um, well, with, uh, um, the Gospel Discussion Show, we're putting on an event in two weeks, a couple of weeks. 
Uh, I got a full, pretty full set already, but I want to invite you brothers to come out. Uh, I don't know if you know um, Prophet X Commons. He's, he's, I used to be out here, but he's in from California now. Okay. And he's going to be one of our guest um, rappers. Okay. Um, look on, when I give you the information for where you guys be able to hear this interview and yeah. stuff, just check out what we have coming up. Okay. And if it's space, I'll be glad to call you guys up. So uh, any, any type of event I have, yeah. come prepared. Okay. Yeah. Even if you don't get up there, just come prepared. Right. Um, like I say, somebody might not come. That It, it might, could be yours, you know. Um, well, that's all I got. I, that's all I got. Anybody else have anything else? No, I just want to um, thank you for having us. It's a blessing to always try to um, meet another man of God that's out there trying to um, help what we do. Because some people kind of shun it because mm -hmm. it's Christian rap. But you know, I appreciate your time and just mm -hmm. having us on the show. No, I appreciate you guys. You guys' time. Be encouraged, so, kids, man. Be encouraged. You guys be encouraged too. Yeah. Don't be, you know what I mean? Don't let anybody turn you away from you know the things that. You know, God is really putting your heart, man. Let man. God lead you and just, just keep your eyes on Christ, man. Don't let, don't be discouraged by anybody else. I don't know who that's going out to, but I really feel like somebody out there right now that's going to hear this needs to know to be encouraged. Don't man. let anybody turn you away from what you feel you know you really have to do. And with that, what I'm going to have this brother do since he, um, he brought that, I'm going to have him pr uh, pray us out of this interview. Who's yes, the prayer? Uh, um, I just well, want to say real quick, right before you end up, uh, um, Battleground City is not just a group of rappers, we're not a record label, uh -huh. we're actually a community development corporation. We believe in reaching out into the community, <clears throat> helping churches, assisting churches any way that we can. Uh -huh. um, we are all not just rappers or singers, but we're teachers, we're, we're ministers, we're, uh, we do workshops, we've done job fairs, we've done health fairs, okay. we've done, we do it all. So uh, we just want to put that out there also. We're not limited as uh -huh. just artists. I know that's one of the misconceptions when you have a, a group of artists or in, individual uh -huh. artists is they're, they're a one-trick pony, that's what they do, so we'll get them, entertain the kids, and then we'll do something different. But that's not what we're about. We're really truly about ministry and, and reaching out to the individuals. We have a heart for the streets. Uh, we have a heart for the urban uh, and, and, and uh, inner city communities. So. Um, we go beyond just the music. The music is a lot of times just a hook mm -hmm. of what we do to draw people in. Yeah, and that's the main thing. Attention. And it's about networking, and, and that's, yeah. what, that's what I've been trying to do tonight is network. Um, um, matter of fact, if you guys could give me a little bio on each one of you and put in what you, you know, whatever your other portion of ministry is, I'll be glad to put it out there. Okay. And then if somebody might need, somebody might need what you have to offer. Yeah. Yes, and then that way, they say, you don't have to give me a 15 page bio or anything, yeah, but just yeah. a little short, you short know, sweet, yeah. Yeah, yeah, short and sweet bio. You know, hey, I'm, I'm, I'm the next um, rich millionaire or whatever, you know, yeah. you need my help, yeah, be help to. become one, something like that, yeah, you know. Yeah. And that way that encourage the people also. Um, well, I thank you. Um, are you ready to pray? Uh, before, Who's going to pray? Before we uh, oh, yeah. end oh. out um, with prayer, uh, we just wanted to uh, let you guys know that we got a project that's going to be dropping at the end of this year, a group project with everybody <clears> on it, okay. from Amadeus, The Ark, The Messenger, Psalm Star, Ridge the Kid, Nate the Mac, and even Rhino, our manager, CEO. Okay. Um, and it's called uh, Br uh, Reservoir, Reservoir, Dogs. Reservoir Dog okay. Grenade Brigade. Um, so keep your eyes out for that. It's a free mixtape. Um, like we said, most of our music is for free. If you would like to donate, it helps what Ryan um, was talking about. You know, it helps us put on the events. It helps us mm -hmm. get ministers to come out here and things like that. Well, I would love to um, get it before you before you start putting it to the public. Mm -hmm. And I'll do an exclusive on it and drop it. That way the public can hear it. Yeah, yeah. And, and they can, um, I'll put you a donation tab okay. on my website. Okay. And then I, if they want to leave a donation, they can. If, if they want to, if they want to download it, uh, we can set something up like yes, that sir. also. Yes, sir. That's perfect. Yeah. Um, but I definitely want to get the exclusive on it. Amen. So, <clears throat> all right. Anything else? All right, Father God, we just thank you for this time, Father God. We yeah. just thank you for this opportunity, Lord, to be able to have a way to get your word out to the people, Father God. Whoever needed to hear this, Father God, I just ask you, Lord to let it to plant deep seeds in their heart, yeah. Father God, to, to fertilize their hearts, Lord, to sow their hearts, Father God, so these seeds that we planted in their life can grow and become strong trees, or strong as oaks, Father God. We don't know your plans, Father God, but we know, Lord, that you have sent us out here, Lord, to do your work, Lord, yeah. and to do your will, Father God. So let us continue to be humble, Father God, can do, continue to let you reign in our life, Lord, decrease us, Lord, to increase you, Father God, so that we can just do your will, Lord, and do your service, Lord. 
Lord, whoever needed to hear this, Father God, let them to receive it with an open heart, Lord, and an open mind, Lord, and continue to cover them in your blood, Jesus. We pray these things, Lord, in Jesus' name. Jesus thank name. God. Amen. 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 Well, thank you, brothers, once more. Thank you. Thank you, sir. I want to thank you guys for coming to this interview. Um, I will let you know. Um, I, I think I'll get one of you guys. Just make sure one of you guys drop by the table. Well. And I got that card. And what I'll do is I'll, I'll um, befriend you. I'll befriend you. Yeah. Or try to find um, the Gospel Discussion Show Facebook page and okay. then click like it. And that way you can see all our upcoming events. It, and then it'll take you behind the scenes of everything. Like I'm trying to create a behind the scenes here. Yeah. And then that way it, 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 uh, um, you will know where to go to here. And where to go to put into our web, our main website. It'll have a link there to go to our main website where you'll be able to hear this. Also, if I don't get catch catch with everybody, but I would love to get everybody connection. I would love to get connected with everybody because, like I say, I'm having an event in in a um, couple of weeks called um, Two Nights of Praise and Worship, and I would love for you brothers to come. Yeah, like I say, even if you don't perform, just come and you know come and get your support out. Um, we got a lot of uh, a lot of um, um, some of the people here that's here tonight. But we have a lot of other talent that's going to be there. I have um, different talents, and it's going to be—it's going to be good. I got—I it was—I I had to cut. My wife kept saying, "Well, you need to cut it. You, you already had eight people, so I, yeah. the minute, I already got up to twelve ministries. Yeah. So I'm praying that it don't go fast like this. Going. <laughs> but it, whatever God has for it, that's what God has for it. Yeah. So you, you brothers, keep up the faith. Keep you know, keep up everything that you're doing. I'm proud of. I'm proud to see all you young brothers doing positive stuff. You know, and, and I don't care if it's rap or well, I don't want to say R&B, but I don't care if it's rap or contemporary gospel or whatever it is. As long as that message of Jesus Christ is getting put out there to our young and to our old and to our middle class, you know, to the sick and the need. You got you guys keep up the good work. Amen. 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 I'm Elder Byron Herndon. You have listened to another episode from the Gospel Discussion Show. Tune in to our next episode as we are here at Youth Quick. And you have been listening to the one and only Battleground City. Woo! Amen. See, baby. Peace out. God, I don't know what to do anymore. I'm at my edge. Heavenly Father, I need you. I need you, Lord Jesus, I need you. Please, I pray to you, I need you in my life. Tossing and turning through the memories, the sad things.
Place me as you see fit Place me where I should be Not where I want to be Because it's not about me But about he My savior My savior So now that salvation is mine's Blessings ain't hard to find The spirit of love, joy and peace How patient is he? Out of the kindness and the goodness of his heart That's faithfulness and gentleness and pure self-control So long live the king Amongst in between heaven and earth Where we all search for his great will and purpose for our lives What we need be still to take Even listen for when the father speaks to answer us Thus we should know his voice And not to question his demands and follow his plans And honor his instructions and obey his command And to accept the corrections of his very hands because his discipline turns children to women and men. I now, now believe in me, has love for me, because our Bible tells me so.
Okay, praise the Lord, everybody, and uh, welcome to KDGDSRadio.com. You have been listening to Mr. Daniel Evans, Nothing's Going to Stop Me. And we have on the line uh, Mr. Evans. Um, Mr. Evans, can you give us what, now I know you're from Enterprise. Enterprise, what, uh, what state is that? Okay, yes, Mr. Daniel Evans from Alabama. And I guess today uh, started listening to Christian music at a young age. He released his first CD last August and has grown on the charts. He is currently on the top five of Hood Gospel Radio and here at KTGDSRadio.com. His name is Mr. Daniel Evans. Welcome, Mr. Evans. Uh, please, can you let our, our audience know um, once again, where you're residing? You said how long I've been residing. Where can you let our audience know once again where where have you been residing? Uh um the reason uh I'm riding um, you know, like I said, the album is called Nothing Gonna Stop Me. And um I feel uh made the album and um, I started writing, you know, at the age of about ten years old. Um I had got out of church for a while, but you know, um you know, got back in church, and my dad had said, you know, no matter, you know, how bad he felt, messed up, you know, he would not let him stop messing with each other, even about the board. So that, you know, motivated me to, you know, get back in church, start back writing, and, and um, you know, rap and everything, and that motivated me to write the song that's going to stop as well as the name of the album that's going to stop. Oh, wow. Yeah, um, it's been hitting, it's been hitting the charts out here in Phoenix, um, from the, from my understanding of the gospel radio, Mama T has been playing regularly. And we've been trying to play regularly also. And um, um, I've, I've checked out a couple of your your um, other things on when I Google Drop and checked out a couple of your other listenings. Uh, uh, you've been on the news, national news. You've been on, uh, well, you've been released, uh, you had a CD released, I seen. Um, your album went national <laughs> last year. How has it been doing? I know, you know, I gave you a Phoenix perspective as as Arizona's results, but nationally, how's it been doing? Um, I, well, I was getting reports uh, pretty soon. I know, you know, I have been, you know, people that I know have been listening to the music and they have been listening to the as well. And then we went to get a little play, you know, and then I thought it was cool, you know, here have, you know, bought the album for me, you know, personally, everything like that. So I have to get my name out here, you know, a little bit. Oh yeah, that's good. That's good. You know, um, um, I always ask all the musicians this: um, Who are your uh, musical influences? Okay, um, I grew up listening to basically like Nicki Soft was probably going to be one of the first um, Christian rap groups or uh, who are Christian hip hop groups um, that I grew up listening to. You know, I think uh, it was just something new. Um, you know, I guess we're rap was getting more popular in the 80s than the uh, early 90s. I guess they put out their first album in 89, but I love like album new thing because, like, you know, they were, you know, was just something new with a good hip-hop play or everything like that. But then they, even after that, the product was cheap on um, he yeah, had the web folks they were, you know, mm-hmm. that style was still like the style because, you know, you talk about fucking down demons and everything like that. They used a new style to the industry, but I still still felt it was adorning, so he was a big influence. And then I also, like, one of folks to pay the settler and hey, him would have been, you know, I could be so he know he does get another gospel music as well. Yes, sir. yes, sir. Okay, um, um, can you let our upcoming gospel young rappers know how God has blessed you with your with your album contract and let them know how how um, God blessed you to get it? Yes, okay. Um, well, um, I, I did. I would take music group, so um, you know they uh, looked up online and I was googling basically you know record label, but then I thought so that record label was looking for musicians. So they could have sent either MP3 or CD. So um, I sent an MP3 of a couple of my songs, and uh, they liked it. So you said they were sent a contract, and um, you know, probably uh, you know a few months later that basically I got the deal. You know, they they didn't respond back to me. They sent MP3 and said they were interested. So basically, you know, that's what happened. It did take a few months after, um, say the whole process of the artwork and everything to get it released. But you know, it was released like um, like you said, August twenty fifth, two thousand thirteen. So you know, I just want to thank the Lord for that. Amen, amen, amen. And I see you perform a lot around town, around your town. I see you do a lot of performance around your town, ministering and different things. Yes, sir. Okay. Um, I'm going to 
okay. Now, um, okay. I know we're running out of time. Just getting a, a okay. cue from my producer. Um, can you give, um, real quick, some advice to the young people? Um, I would just tell them, you know, uh, focus on God, you know what I'm saying, and make sure, you know, that's the reason you're doing it. It's, uh, uh, take some notes and little stuff, you know what I'm saying, but, you know, make sure you get God's glory. Um, but, you know, walk with your blessings as well. And then just, if it's really something you want to do, just, you know, work hard at it, and then just keep praying and just focus on God. And, uh, you know, just stay humble and God will bless you and open up doors. Hey Amen. Um, your album is in stores now. Um, well, you can get it at takemusical.com or you can download it off the popular sites like iTunes, Amazon, and Spotify, and everything like that. And also, what we do, we're, we're on, on on this page where you we want to have a link uh, connected to all those. We want to do uh, um, uh, if I can get you to uh, put in my Facebook inbox the link to all those, then I'll make one link. Going to okay. all the ones that you where you can where they can purchase it also when they click on our our radio station also. Okay, I appreciate that. And his uh, his single is entitled, or his hits, um, album is entitled "Nothing Is Going to Stop Me." You can buy it. Okay. You can purchase it where um, he stayed. Up and it, now is it is it on anywhere digital besides the is it at Walmart or any places like that yet? Uh, Okay, now are you selling your songs, your, your songs as single songs also? Oh uh, yeah, you can also buy, you know, a single song for $99. Okay, and I'm sure, pretty sure that's at iTunes. Okay, well, um, we will definitely be playing playing your music um, recently, more and more and more recently, and more and more and more. Uh, we'll try to keep you at the uh, top, uh, number one top, <laughs> as you're going to be moving up in the charts. It, it looks like you're in, in another fellow young man named Justified has been, been in the race. But we're going to try to keep you up at the top, amen, and, 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 and much as we can. And I want to thank you for this interview this morning. Okay. All right, I appreciate it. All right, sir. God bless, and we'll be looking forward to meeting you. All right, we'll look forward to meeting you. God bless you, too. Thank you. Amen. Yeah. So then, faith cometh by hearing, and hearing by the word of God. Gospel discussion show. We get it in. Putting the radio waves with the gospel. We get it in. Stretch up in your home like an apostle. We get it in. After heard and doing it big for the Lord, we get it in. Putting in work, serving the King, answering His we call. We get it in. Interviews, gospel talk, watch the anointing fall. We get it in. Loving Jesus Christ, repping He's the Lord. We get it in. We all about Christ and lifting Him up. We get it in. Nothing but majesty and power reigning from His throne. We get it in. Call us doctors, cause we got your healing remedy. We get it in. For the saints and even the folks that ain't no kin. We get it in. Preaching, rapping, even signing for the Lord. We get it in. He is the way, so turning him down. Something you can't afford. We get it in. Gospel. 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 Gospel.